SmartStat, advanced simulation made easy. SmartStat, out of the box. This is a head-to-toe review of the SmartStat system. Head features include fluids for the eyes, nose, and foaming mouth controlled independently. Fluid-filled ports for the internal fluids are located on the top of the right shoulder. These include the blood reservoir and head fluids. Fluid management will be covered at a later time. Light reactive eyes that can be selectively controlled for CNS evaluation. Mouth that can indicate cyanosis and carbon monoxide flushing with varying intensity. Oral and nasal intubation head built around a unified airway. Controllable tongue and layer inks edema to complicate airway management. Breakaway teeth to train better blade technique. Carotid pulses and IV access and needle cracothyrotomy. On chest sternum, fast IO access and bilateral chest decompression sites. Periocentesis sites with fluids. One of the bilateral chest drains with fluids. Upper arm IM site. The chest also has ECG sites and DFib sites. Near the upper left arm is a bleed tube for venting an optional trauma arm. On the arms, there are bilateral blood pressure ports, inside right arm, outside left arm. In the anti-cubital, there is the blood pressure speaker and the IV access site. Dorsal on the hand are additional IV sites and reactive fingers. Fingers can reflect cyanosis or carbon minoxide. Pulse ox is included on the right index finger. The abdomen plate. Left femoral pulse points, the bowel sound speakers for the four quadrants of the abdomen, and the right femoral pulse point. Stomach inflation bag. Abdomen fill reservoir for the chest fluids and the catheterization complementing the six anterior lung sounds and four cardiac sounds are the four posterior lung sound sites. Interchangeable genitalia supporting catheterization. Thigh IM pad, a USB port, external power connection, and CAT5 cable. Of these, only the external power connection is used by the end user. On the left knee are the connection tubes for pedal pulses and right leg blood tube. Knee pin for lower leg. Exhaust fan for internal compressor. The right knee has the two quick connectors for the pedal pulses and a battery leg connection for internal power. This is the right knee with color coded tube connected for pedal pulses. The blood tube can be used for venting and connecting to optional trauma limbs. Note the hole for the knee pin for connecting the limb to the simulator. The pin slides through the thigh across the limb to the other side and is secured with a simple screw that is hand tightened.
Once connected, the feet will be able to have pedal pulses. To power the simulator, connect the external power in the 6-pin power block on the right leg or the battery leg on the left leg. The external power block may have a separate transformer and cable. The power switch is located on the upper left shoulder. Toggle to turn on the simulator. It's that easy.